Well, I, so, I had a I had a girl that uh that I did counseling for, and she was uh she was with this. I, it was like a couples counseling thing I did, and the guy called me up. And he said, "Look, my girl, she keeps cheating on me. She keeps she was first she was twenty five years old. She was uh she was stripping." And she, she was a stripper, so she's probably smoking hot. And right. she really liked him. But she, so I first thing I go when I say, I go, were you ever molested? She goes, yeah. And I go, at what age? And she goes, 11. And I go, uh, was so she, it, she's, <laughs> yeah, I, I was I was just, uh, it was interesting because it, it, there's, I said, well, let me explain to you that there's this phenomenon because as an 11-year-old, you think that, you know, sex and intimacy is supposed to be, it's a, sex is supposed to yeah. maintain intimacy. And then the people who are adults who look at you and go, hey, you're looking up to these adults. It's, supposed it's to like keep a you. dirty, bad thing where you, right. I do this with losers because I'm bad. And then. Right. Oh, it's, it's, it's also kind of like, it's yeah. like poison. It's like you're poisoning their concept of intimacy. And you so are. if you, mm -hmm. if you got an eyedropper full of arsenic, it doesn't, it doesn't hurt you as much as if you put it in a gallon of water or if you put it in, right. if you drink, so you're diluting this intimacy yeah. with, with, with multiple sex partners because intimate sex is just sex. It's, it had, there is no intimacy in it. So it's watering down. And, and that's right. what you come up with when you're 11 years old. The problem is, is somebody is, yeah, they get 40, frozen. You get it, frozen at that age. Yeah. Right, it's like going. It's like doing prison. Like when people, you know, remember when uh, and uh, I'm gonna get you, sucker. They, they, you know, Antonio Fargas comes out with the same with the goldfish in the shoes because he's yeah, right. he's frozen in that moment, and he never. And so you're living he this comes life out of the prison the way he went, wearing what he went in in the seventies. Yeah. Yes, which yeah. was yeah. Rogers. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And then he goes, and then he, and then he comes out, and then, and, but he's living. You're living a life. And you've learning different social engagements, different ways to deal with different social situations, but you never reassess the the the, the tragedy or the, the 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 trauma with the information that you have as a forty year old person, and so you're still acting in the same way you were acting when you were eleven years old to to deal with that trauma, and so it just continues. And, could, and so a lot of times, just recognizing that this is what you're doing, I mean, it doesn't change it, but the recognition of it can, can get you to the point where you start to go down that creek. let me I, I i need to change my thinking and yeah. uh and and she just you know and just saying that to her made her go like bing oh shit like i never even thought of it that way i mean sometimes people are just not they don't have the uh, the intellectual acuity to kind of make the connection i, I just even need, with oh, it it could be hard you know yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, but you got to, and, and it's never easy. I mean, it's always hard. It's, but it can it's, be hard, but you're never going to fix it without it, though. You might got to You got yeah, to make no a different decision. You man school, 202. Better hear what I've got to say because you won't get it again. I'm not an alpha male. I'm not a beta male either. I'm just a better man. Better man.